Blitz up the middle. Walker's going to keep it. He's going to fight his way into the end zone for Washington. Touchdown. And a late flag for celebration. That's a costly flag. I'm not really sure. Didn't look like Walker was self-aggrandizing. It looked like he was celebrating with his teammates. I'm not very sure I agree with that flag at all. I hate that call to begin with. I, I can see it if players come off the bench to celebrate. Then it makes sense to me. If you're celebrating with excitement with your teammates, that is a bad call. No question about it. What a run. Unsportsmanlike conduct on number 10 of the offense. Celebration after the play. 15-yard penalty on the try. You know, you make a play for your team, you have a very difficult drive. That was the 18th play. And you get a penalty like that when you're excited. What a what a run that showed great desire and want to. I guess they're saying he kind of spiked it behind his head. I disagree. I really disagree with that call. BYU will call a timeout with two seconds left. Now, this is no gimme here. This ball will Not be now. snapped at the... 18-yard line. It makes it a 35-yard extra point try. Ryan Perkins, one for one versus Oregon. 35-yard field goal. Now, I, I'm sorry. I just do not agree. I know it's a point of emphasis. I know it's a rule. I know the official. You can't say that it's the wrong call by the official. You can only say it's the wrong judgment. I guess they're saying that he kind of spiked it behind his head, but he's just kind of getting rid of the ball. And e eager to celebrate with his teammates, and that's what they tell you. You practice that when you score in, in practice. They say, celebrate with your teammates. Don't self-aggrandize. That's exactly what Locker did. Exactly. Now here's the game. Wasn't in anybody's face now a 35-yard extra point try by Ryan Perkins to take it to overtime. It's blocked. And that is purely in the hands of the officials. Now there's a flag for BYU. There's two seconds left. That's excessive celebration. They ran out on the field with two seconds left. The clock doesn't run on a PAT try. So BYU is going to get excessive celebration, but it's not going to matter. And this is one that you could blame on the officials. I really believe that we would have had an overtime game had they not thrown that flag Ten on ball, Jake Locker. Unsportsmanlike conduct against the BYU bench. 15-yard penalty on the kickoff. Now, as we said, when you come off the bench, I can see it, but absolutely did not see it with it, with that. If it was in somebody's face, if he spiked the ball, and there was an opponent standing there or anything like that, then yes. BYU played a great game here. Coming through, they had to block this kick to end the game. That's exactly what they did. Great push up the middle, great push on the edges. The UW PAT team collapsed completely. Looked like Perkins' foot slipped a little bit, but that kick was up. It looked like a pretty strong kick, just 